Hello everybody, welcome to the video. I'm Viceroy and today we're going to take a look at Crime Scene Cleaner Prologue. Uh, I downloaded the prologue a couple of, well, about a week back actually with the intent of making a video but I uh, didn't quite find time for it and now the full version's out. So uh, yeah, you don't have to just play the prologue, you can play the full version which was released on, let me check here, the 14th of August this year, 2024. But seeing as we have the prologue downloaded and my internet is crap, let's try this. Here, player, step into the prologue of Crime Scene Cleaner and immerse yourself in the captivating world of Shady Cleanup. Thank you for giving it a go. This version will allow you to take a peek at the challenges of this unique profession, introducing you to some of the features available in the full game. Now available. Prologue is a free opportunity for you to decide whether Crime Scene Cleaner is just the right game for you. If you haven't done it yet, stay updated on the full game or show your support, you should add Crime Scene Cleaner to your wishlist. So, are you ready? Well, are you ready, kids? Enjoy the... This definitely isn't for kids. <laughs> Enjoy the prologue to the fullest. The devs. Press return to continue. So, Crime Scene Cleaner. Here we go. What's it about? You get a clean crime scenes, obviously. Once you get tangled with the mob, you will forever be a part of the mob. At least they pay a decent salary and all you have to do is clean up after their dirty work. But you know what you're doing. So clean crime scenes, earn as much money as you can and get ready for the next mission. That's what the description is on uh, Steam, by the way. I'll link the game down below if you want to check out the full version and the prologue. I'll, I'll put a link to both so you can check them out. Without further ado, view the intro and let's get started. It's open, just come in. Hi, is Mark back home already? He should be in a few minutes. Do you want something to drink while waiting? No thanks. Ooh, damn. I think she might be dead. Oh, there was a kid in the house. Not that makes you any better, but still. <laughs> Did we sleep with our gloves on? Uh, where's the phone? Uh, need to interact. Son of a bitch was having an affair with my wife. So I just offed him and his entire family. The problem is Ooh. I didn't really think it through, so you'll need to get rid of the surveillance footage as well. The blood I'll thickens. I'll send you the address over email. I just need to wash this blood off me first. That doesn't sound good, but duty calls. Okay. Accept mission from your computer. Computer. Where for Arthur computer? Ooh, what's this? Beholding the grandeur of the Venetian-inspired marvel, the Jamans were inspired to craft this opus as a tribute to its magnificence. Put back. Sponge. Every crime scene. Cleaners must have tool. Is that haunted? Where's the computer? Yeah, computer. Oh, there's a computer. Okay. Um, cleaning services AS needed ASAP. Accept mission. Body count five. Location size three out of four. Mission payment, $15,000. Well, that's not a bad amount of money, is it? I don't know what the going rate for this type of thing is, but fifteen grand seems quite reasonable. Okay. Drive straight to King's Crossing Street 6, uh, Crampton's District. Erase the surveillance footage. You'll need five body bags with a Z. Don't forget about that dead asshole in the, is in the basement. Make it look nice and clean and better not fuck this up. Remember, you owe us. Okay. Go to the car. I'm guessing all our tools will already be in the car. But we'll find out. 
open. Not a bad car. Do we drive or do we just point and click? Uh, Mr. House of Mr. Castle. Active mission. Impulsive mobster killed a bunch of people at some rich guy's mansion. He left five bodies and plenty of evidence behind. I need to clean up his mess before the police get here. Okay. And he hasn't told me I need to load anything into the car, so I'm assuming we have everything we need. Uh, it'll be a long night. Doesn't sure if the car was going to start then. Chapter six. A calm before Mancha the Massacre storm. Cleaner. It was supposed to be a little cleaning trip for a not so little rich man's villa, earning myself some extra cash from a new client. Instead, it was the beginning of a devastating chain of events. We're here. Okay. Um, find a way into the villa. Dispose of the bodies. Just as easy as that. For the bodies. That was a lovely looking uh, area. Tool wheel. Press T to view codex entry. Uh, open tool wheel to access your tools. Once you do, you will not only see available tools, but also some corresponding hotkeys to the same features. However, however, hover your mouse over a desirable tool on the tool wheel and press left click to see more options. Okay. So we need to... Additional tools. Okay. Um, axe. We axe the gate open. No, we just we just open the gate. location and lock swimming pool. Holy fuck! Wow. Bloodbath. Okay. It's a very red looking pool. Washing blood stains. Washing stains is one of the Cleaning activities you will have to do most of the time. You have to be thorough in your cleaning to wash the blood completely. You can use a mop, pressure washer, or sponge to wash the blood. Each tool has its advantages and disadvantages. For example, a sponge effectively removes difficult stains on rough materials but has a smaller cleaning range, while a pressure washer cleans large surfaces but can easily damage objects. Choose the appropriate tools for the situations you encounter. What would be appropriate for this? Now, I, I would say, um, probably not an axe. Pressure washer for large stains. Um, I can do a police. Is that good? Probably not. I mean, pressure washer isn't going to damage the floor, right? Well, there's bullet casings on the floor. Okay. We no longer stepping bloody footprints over the place. Doesn't seem so. It is new. Okay, so we put this back. Oh, water source. There are tools, bucket, pressure washer that require water for their use. To fill them, look for a water source marked with a special icon, which indicates the nearest one when you hold a tool requiring water. Place your tool at the water source and wait a moment until it is completely filled with water. Water in buckets can become dirty with blood over time, requiring uh, requiring you to refill them with clean water. Okay. Um, all to collect. We have to pick these. Uh, we have a trash bag or something we can use to get these. Garbage can. Ah, yes. Okay. That's where he was shot for the first time. Managed to walk a few steps and fell into the water. Oh, I missed a spot. Blood on the floor. So at least it's given us a sort of like rundown of the area we're in. Like how much more rubbish we have to collect and how good we've done at cleaning the blood off the floor. We obviously missed a footprint, which may or may not be ours. <laughs> oh, hang on. Hold to collect multiple. Ah, 
that's handy. That's much better. Seems to be stuck behind you too. Oh wait, why can't we pick that up? Oh, the bag's full, that's why. Right, T. Pick a point is a place where you bring found bodies and trash bags. In most, <clears throat> in most cases, this will be the trunk of your pickup truck, but it could also be a different place depending on the ongoing task. Leave your item at the pickup point is easy. Just throw the body and garbage bags there, and they will be carefully arranged. Okay, so do we pick up the bag? Well, let's fill up another bag first. We still have some items collect. So 40 of 40, that's all the trash picked up. Lots of trash can be found all over the crime scene and can serve later as evidence. You have to collect it in your garbage can. Yep, already done that. So how do I put the garbage bag away? Um, I want to put it away. Ah, there we go. Pick up and let's take this to the car. Which way was it to the car? And there's one piece of evidence we need to collect. Can we run? Yes, we can. If that goes in... Ah? Ah, cool. Okay. Just kind of, uh... Attach yourself appropriately to the car. Do 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 do. Right. Cool. Um... Blood. A sponge is a cleaning tool known for its high precision. When using a sponge, you can avoid shattering some delicate items as its movements don't push uh, other objects and it also doesn't harm delicate surfaces. Use it when you don't want to create additional mess. The sponge is also great for cleaning demanding surfaces such as carpets or certain types of furniture due to its higher stain penetration capability compared to a mop. Remember that a sponge also gets dirty over time and will need to be rinsed in a bucket of water. I think mop might be a good idea, actually, for this bit. Yeah, look at that mopping action. A mop is one of the most essential tools in your profession. You can you use it to clean bloodstains, mud, and anything else required for your task. As you use it, the mop gets dirty over time, and when it reaches the maximum level of dirtiness, it starts creating more stains instead of removing them. That's when you should rinse your mop in a bucket of, with water. Got it. We still have more garbage to collect. Oh, it says we have all the garbage. There's one piece of evidence we need to collect. And there's probably a way of draining the pool because, like, we can't leave it like that. There might be, like, a pump or something we need to activate to do that bit. You need to collect this stuff? No. Oh, that, that stuff's alright. Empty the pool. Okay, so how do we do that? I'm guessing this arrow is pointing to where we need to go to do that? Quite likely, isn't it? Uh, yes. Kind of obvious, really, wasn't it? Empty the pool. Maybe we clean, like... Now we mop the pool out, or do we use chemicals? Probably going to use the pressure washer. So we need to put this by the water source. Fill it back up. Ah, yeah, little water things on the front. Water indicator. Nice. And then we pressure wash the pool. We will eventually learn the shortcuts of these things. Body disposal. Once you find a dead body, it should be removed from the crime scene. Pick it up and take it to your car and throw it in the trunk. It should turn into a body bag. And like I say, it should. Oh, I didn't even see the body. Dina's sense. Dina's sense is your special type of intuition, which helps you a lot with polishing the crime scene to perfection. 
Every now and then you are able to activate a special type of vision which highlights every element of the crime scene. Everything you see is colour coded, blood can range from violet to red depending on the difficulty of the stain and surface. Trash cans glow, uh, trash glows green and missing pieces of furniture appear blue. Press Q to use cleaner scents. Nyom. Now, how long to the last day after you fall? Oh, not very long, okay. Dee 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 Ooh, what's that? <gasps> Critical evidence. Maybe. We're too far from the pressure washer. Okay. It does have a decent range on it, to be fair. Oh, we're out of water. I think we are out of water. Who the watering hole? Oh. Ah, I see him getting used to this. And the keys are the evidence. We'll pick them up. Um, probably should finish washing first, though. So, boop. Use. This must have been one hell of a party. It wasn't even a party, was it? It was just a family, um, just doing their own thing. Workshop key. New story item. Ooh. That doesn't probably doesn't belong in the pool. Any more blood? Any more blood? Do we have any more blood? Nope. Let's grab the body. Watch Come with me. Back. One in the head. He didn't really stand a chance. You were messing about, was he? That's for sure. In you go. Just one of your footsteps then. Okay, so oh, there's a little icon in the corner that tells you how long left. Oh, there's a body up there too. Oh, that was way too hard. <laughs> From way Yay. Downtown. Incognito mode. Ooh. <laughs> the whole game revolves around collecting money for the treatment of your sick daughter. Sometimes you may find your payment not enough. There are a lot of valuable items laying around the crime scene and some of them may be stolen. To steal a valuable item and sell it for some extra cash, move your mouse cursor over the item and press E. Good to know. This is clearly not worth anything though, this stuff. Oh, we found a hundred dollars. Okay, evidence from the swimming pool. I have more. So the keys were in the evidence. Okay. Looks nice and clean now. We have to refill the pool, so it looks like above board and stuff. What happens if we try to refill the pool? Does that refill the pool? Ah, oh, cool. Okay. Nice clean water. Look at that. Nothing bad happened here. Okay. Probably should we fill this, shouldn't we? Just in case. Yeah, let's go inside, shall we? Won't budge. Ah. Looks like some kind of electronic lock. We set fuses. Do we do this in the same place as the pump? Let's see if he was boxed. I'm gonna empty the pool again, isn't it? Yep. Don't need to do that. Nope, other way. What's in here? Ooh, workshop key. Used. Right. Mr. Castle, can I talk to you for a second? About what? Um, we found, found the evidence. Brenner. What are you trying to... I saw you two last night. Even took some photos. But your wife doesn't need to see him. 
I just... Shut up. Not here. Let's go inside. One affair too far, Mark. Evidence. I think we shall take that. Okay, so we've found all the evidence. We've cleaned up all the rubbish from this scene. Money. We'll use money like that in a workshop. All right, is there a fuse box in here? Yes, there is. That should open the main door. Okay. Find a way into the villa. Well, the music started now. Didn't even notice the power is off, to be fair. Ground floor. Right. Delete surveillance recordings. Wipe all the blood. More money. Oh, I like them. Good old times. <laughs> now I have to deal with Jennifer's body. Oh, so she was like a, a star. The plot thickens. A key? Where am I supposed to find a key in this mess? Yeah, it's probably here somewhere. Make it look nice and clean. Ooh, yeah. We can't pick up the balls. Why? Hmm. Oh. That's why. Has to look like nothing happened. We just filled up another bag, didn't we? Yep. Do 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 do. Oh, another body. With us, Jennifer. Oh, we're seven in a little bed. A lovely house. Attacked by surprise. Probably had no idea somebody's after her husband. Nope, completely oblivious to the entire situation, unfortunately. Caught in the crossfire. Oh, we get blood all over the floor. Mop. Right, where is our cleanliness thing of the mop? I think we're at it. I'm guessing that's what the red splashes are about. So, we need to get the bucket. Water bucket is used for cleaning a mop or a sponge. Before use, it must be filled with water, which can be done at water sources marked with a special icon. Put down the bucket at the water source and it will automatically attach itself in the correct position and begin to fill. This action causes the bucket to fill and... If it was already filled before, it replaces the contaminated water. Keep in mind that this action removes poured detergents from the bucket. Ah, detergents. So we need to get some water. Bucket number six. La 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 la. Mop. Feed mop. And then continue de blooding the floor. Probably should use the sponge for the rug, shouldn't we? Probably a good idea. Pressure washing inside, probably not a good idea. Is a lot of blood. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of blood. <laughs> Hiding up the room. Furniture may be found lying all around the location in utter chaos. To tidy up the room, you should move all the pieces of furniture to the designated places. A cleaner sense may be found helpful to where to see where all the scattered elements belong, as it will show you blue holograms as guidance. 
At a crime scene, sometimes you'll find messy furniture that should be adjusted correctly. To fix it, you have to uh, you need to have your hands equipped, then hover your mouse over the broken elements and hold the left mouse button to adjust it to the desired position. If the furniture is stained with blood, you must wash it before adjusting it. One to equip hands. Got it. Detergents. Detergents are enhancements that you may use by pouring them into a filled bucket of water. They can have various effects such as prolonging the time before the mop gets dirty. Be careful because if you pour out the water or replace it, the detergent's effect will disappear. To activate any effect, rinse the mop in a bucket with detergent added. Okay. Well, that's definitely dirty now, isn't it? Come with me, bucket. Do 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 do. And clean. Oh, where's the trash bag? These bullets are a dead giveaway if something happened. Right, mop, but do, and mop away. I have to use the sponge for that because it's on the carpet. Or maybe we just haven't got in the right position. Oh, there we go. Oh, crap. Well, that's the thing. <laughs> Note to self. Be careful around the bucket. Oh, we knocked it over again then. La 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 la. Red. Oops. Ah, oh, damn it. Who we'll knocked the bucket over this time? <laughs> Find some detergents in here, maybe. What's in there? Nothing. Uh, oh, wait. Got detergent seven. Ah. Equip ozone ozone and eater. Um uh, don't add us for a minute, so we'll leave that. Right, we have some magical concoction in here now. Don't know what it's gonna do, but it can only be helpful, right? Right. Bing 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 bing. Super effective. The mop became super effective. Oh wow! Mop here is pretty much as ineffective as mopping around. We'll see. Stick to mopping the floor. The detergent definitely helped. But I don't mean to mop you. Maybe I should have moved the body body first. Oh, I worked on the stool. <laughs> okay. Evidence. That's unfortunate. Multiple gunshot wounds. The attacker clearly went off the deep end. Did he blame her for her husband's? It was a crime of passion. There you go. Ta da. I think we need Mr. Sponge. There we go. And fix. Nice. Um, that's just wine. We need to clean that. Let's have a look. Yes, yes we do. Ah, just like new. So we pick the bottle up, put it down nicely. There we go. Can we pick more than one bag up at a time? Yes, we can. They combine into a super bag. That's good to know. <laughs> Biohazard. Infectious waste. No kidding. I'm glad it breaks down the house in like... Um, 
area by area task. So we've done all the swimming pool tasks, so it's good to know. Go back up to the main house. Um, this part of the room seems okay. Oh, there's a tap in there. We didn't have to go outside. Good to know. Okay. Let's, um, yeah, let's get the sponge back out. And we put these all back in nicely. I should clean it first. Ah, okay. The shulker for the sponge five. There we go. Like new. I can't put it back like that. Why not? Clean. First things first. Gotta scrub, scrub, scrub. But it is clean. Oh wait, no it's not. Now it's clean. <laughs> A little red outline give that away, I suppose. So using this then won't knock things over on the table. Um, this needs cleaning. And uh, that's dirty. Okay. Uh, bathroom. Nope, that was not way. Bathroom is this way. Fuck it. Urgent. Careful with the bucket. Now we're super effective at cleaning. So, gotta be careful, I suppose, cleaning paintings, because it could go, uh, like, remove the paint. Then it'll look kind of obvious that it's been cleaned, wouldn't it? Um, ah, just like new. That, however, is not. La 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 la. Yeah, imagine using a pressure washer would destroy this kitchen. All the blood from this area seems to be, apart from my dirty footsteps. Okay. Cleaner senses. Zoom. Um. Ah, okay. The clip into position when you get more or less where it needs to be. Yeah, there we go. Cool. Oh, that's dirty. Nice. Doesn't have to be perfect. Want to smash that? Are we missing a chair? Missing several chairs, apparently. Where'd you go? Good as new. Was that dirty? And a tip. How oh, kind. Okay, that's... I think that's all the dining table stuffs. What does that mean? Uh, right, this needs a bit of cleaning. Bum, 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 bum. Where's the other one? Never bought these. Maybe you could have saved your family. Yeah, probably not. But you never know. Ah, oh, there's the other one. Is it got blood on it? No, it does not. Okay, we're getting there. We're getting there. Um. Uh, this one needs cleaning. Bum, 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 bum. Ah, where's this girl? Yeah. 
Oh, that's where the ball goes. Use my cleaner senses. Did we miss a spot on the wall there? Yes, we did. Okay. We jump? Oh, we can jump. Good to know. Ah, poor fishies. Looks clean to me. It is new. Now we need to refill our bucket. We're missing two chairs and oh, there's one. Uh, where's the mop? Number two. And dirty footprints all over the floor. How dare we? Okay. What are we missing? We're missing one chair. Ooh. Let's wipe that off. Where's that other chair gone? surveillance room hacking sometimes there are computers at the crime scene that can contain any, some important information or evidence in order to search through it and delete it interact with a computer and proceed to the right folder or file and a notification about restricted access may appear to go around the security system you can try to hack it uh, hack into it there are two ways you can choose from manual hacking and brute force hacking once the hacking is complete, you obtain access to protected content, which now you may delete. Okay. Is this it? Ooh, it is. Looks like it anyway. Manual hacking. Um, 6143. What do we do? Um, 6. 1, 4. Two one nine six. Two one nine six. Well, hey, look at that! First attempt. Delete. 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 And delete. All footage has been deleted. I don't know if we're supposed to have deleted it all, but we did. Right. Ooh, evidence. This message evidence. Didn't age well. He knows about us. Um, ah, there we go. He knows about us. Stay safe, my dearest. I hope to be with you soon. Yeah, that didn't pan out, did it? That's all the evidence collected. Now we just need to move the furniture back into its respectful place. Anything in this room to do? No. We are missing a chair. Where's that chair gone? Ah, there it is. Is there such a thing as too clean? Ground floor. Location cleaned. Yay. We've got three more bodies to find. We've left no evidence. So I guess we go... Is there anything across here? Nope. That one's locked. Make sure there's nothing across this way. But it is a ground floor dinner, so I guess that covers all this. Ah, the basement. Jesus, Ooh. That one was tortured. Damn. <laughs> ah, um, back it. Oh, wait. Um, oh, back upstairs. <laughs> you need, we need to fill our bucket. Na, 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 na. Ooh, evidence. Handy for breaking bones. Very much so. As if one wasn't enough. Ooh, painful. Ooh, crap. You jumped at me. <laughs> Come with me, sir. Stab wounds. Some drill marks. Easy to see it was deeply personal. So that must Hopefully he's not still bleeding. High mark. High mark. Hi, Mark. Flashlight. 
You may find it hard to see anything in some dark places. In this type of situation, flashlight is a lifesaver. Press F. Ah, handy. This was not a drill. <laughs> but it was. This was five evidences. Basement. Oh, basement complete. Okay. Um. Ah. Here we go. Yes, we have two bodies left to find. Probably both upstairs. To the second floor. Okay. Two evidence. 42 trash. Furniture to be moved and blood. Clean. Well, there's definitely something happened in that room. Okay, so sponge works a lot better for carpet. Mop does really well with flooring. Yeah, we're getting it, we're getting it. Hopefully there's a somewhere up here we can clean our bucket. And hopefully we haven't stepped in any blood. Okay. Trash bags. Ooh, evidence. Were legit. Dad had an affair and fucked the whole family by accident. Sometimes a fist icon appears, indicating the need to break something even further. That's when you should approach a target, e.g. a door, and prepare for a fierce punch. It may take multiple strikes to break the object completely. If you unlock a hatchet in the skill tree, you can use it to destroy items more quickly. But, like, we've destroyed the door, so... Yes, that's going in a bag. Right, bucket. Anywhere up here we can renew our bucket. Really? There isn't? Damn. I got all the way down here. Rise is no like bathroom on the first floor. It was a mega far to go, I suppose, so it wasn't too bad. Just mop the furniture. I should use a sponge. Okay. I guess he knows best. We'll probably fix this now, though, can't we? Like no one was ever here. Exactly. Exactly. Or did the game think I was trying to um, mop the carpet? I wasn't gonna. Honest. We try pouring detergent in there now. What will happen? Ah, that was childish. <laughs> so, <laughs> be careful with your bucket, folks. That's the key takeaway from this. Oh, so far, I'm really enjoying this game. It was quite fun. It's not what I, was, I thought it was going to be. For whatever reason, I thought we would be like a crime scene investigator cleaner, as in like... After the police have done their investigation and we go into clean up afterwards, I didn't realize that we were like the uh, on call for the mob essentially to uh, clean up after them. I think that might be the last of this. Resistance detergent. Okay. Without kicking over the bucket, let's do this. Should we clean the laptop? Keep calm and live, laugh, love. 
Ah. Oh, ironic. Can I move that? Is it because of the trash? Ooh, evidence. A, a hatchet will do. I think we're doing okay. I'm seeing investigator extraordinaire. I put that bucket in a bad place, didn't I? It'd be quite easy to knock over, I reckon. Okay, so we got 32 out of 45 trash. Just uh, go back to clean in a sec, though. I should use a sponge. I was gonna. This is a rug. Sponge is much better on the rug. Could use a map. I think that's most things in this room. I need to go back. Oh. Handprint. Bloody handprint on there. Keeping calm is the best I can do. Where's this go? Ah, there. Yeah, oh, we're good at this, aren't we? Everything as it was. Almost. Guessing this goes in front of here. My crime scene senses told me so. And this probably goes on there. Nice. Oh, wait, there is a... Uh, there is a tap on this floor. Um, I think that's more or less it for this room, isn't it? Oh, you know, apart from the body on the balcony. I need to be careful so she doesn't fall. Fuck. But I only opened the. Ow! How did she fall? I only opened the door. That's everything out here. Um, ah, I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> I should not have done that. Right. Grab this and grab this. Go downstairs. Pick up the body. We'll take this back to the car. Then we'll pick up the body. And maybe repair the table. But I don't understand how that body fell. Was this something to do with, like, I don't know. Um, air turbulence or something as we opened the door. <laughs> but the house of Mr. Castle is almost clean. Almost. Ooh, what a mess. Can't really call it a soft landing. I mean, this table was never here. Okay. Can we pick up the body? Hard to imagine yes, we can. A child like that. It's quite bad, isn't it? Like, the family didn't do it, but the family suffered. 99% of the blood we got, so there's a little bit more left to find. Nope, that's not a hatchet. Be obvious that this is missing. I like that popping noise it makes as it comes out of the bag. Okay. 
Pick all the blood. What do we do with these things? A bit dodgy if they're just on the floor, isn't it? Like, like so. Kind of obvious that that's missing. Bing. We're flying through this now, so that's all the garbage bags. One more body left to find. We not made a mess at all, have we? No, all good. This is lovely and clean. And then there's that room. Okay, we'll just double check. We have done everything in this room first. We're probably going to need our trusty bucket. Uh, move all furniture back to its original place. Everything in this room is done, so the last of the furniture is just in the other room, I'm guessing. Okay, so we... I think... Close this nicely. Why wouldn't it be closed? I think... It's for our daughter. It's for a good cause. Laptop probably should be where it is. Necklace. Yoink. I wonder if we steal too much and, like, look obvious that it was a burglary or something. Okay, that room is clean. I declare this room clean. Here's the bucket. Come with me, bucket. We have work to do. What do we have here? Oops. UV lamp. They say UV lamp on the floor vertically and turn it on to make it highlight all the blood and hidden traces, similar to how a cleaner sense does, but with no need to turn it on uh, again and again. You may find it exceptionally helpful with some places full of lots of blood. Be careful not to tip the lamp over, otherwise it will not work. Ah. Ooh, handy. Must be careful, though. With all the stuff and things. And don't tip it over. We guarantee we're going to, right? Okay, so let's take the body downstairs. Just imagine playing some FPS and ending up with a bullet in your head. Now that's what I call immersion. We're not tracking blood through the house, are we? No, good. Okay. This is the last body, so then what we gotta do is finish cleaning our room, and the house is as if nothing ever happened. Which it didn't. Naturally. <laughs> Ugh, no need to thank me. Take photos in swimming pool. Um, why? Like in the swimming pool. Oh. Okay, so does guide us where he actually wants us to take photos. <laughs> Who's the other one? Don't know where it wants the other photo. Oh there. People are already shouting at the screen right now, saying it's in the pool. Take photos in the basement. But we've not finished yet. We still haven't finished cleaning upstairs. We're looking out for the little blue things. Good to know. Take photos in the first floor. That wise, we've not finished the first floor yet. Yeah, let's finish cleanup first. Joyful nihilism. Is that what makes this whole ride worthwhile? Hey, Edge Lord, just take the edge off. Oh, we did the bucket again. Okay, let's refill the bucket again, shall we? To the bathroom. 
Are those sirens for us? He's got like a proper green screen and everything. <laughs> proper game studio. Or streaming studio, should I say. That's fine. Chairs are good. Yeah, it literally killed him. Gamers, brace yourselves. Um, well, this side of the room seems okay. Green screen, however, is not really green, is it? Let's fix that. That's all the blood. I just got to put the furniture back. And this place can be declared clean. Right. Uh, drum. That's not this drum, is it? There we go. This drum, stool. This is a stool. Ta da! What's that? Like a musician mastering the ups and downs of a composition, a leader adequate. Uh, ad adeptly navigates the complexities of social dynamics and geopolitical challenges. Where does this streaming light go? Oh, look at the wallpaper. How appropriate. <laughs> We should move the bucket out of the way, shouldn't we? Um, right, here goes there. The chair's dirty, is it? Give it the once over. There we go. Basketball. Probably can go anywhere. There we go. By the bed. clean yet. Ah, there we go. I mean, this garbage makes it look authentic, truly. It was just thrown all over the floor. Yeah, that's all the garbage. Nice. Uh, so there's two more pieces of furniture to move back into place. But this is probably one of them. Where's this going? I've been playing. Where does this go? Hello, computer. Oh, what's in there? Ah, balcony. The one Where does this go? Where's the other drum? Money. There's two hundred dollars casually hanging out on the balcony. Is that a laundry key? Surely we have finished the house.
photos of the ground floor. First floor, move furniture back into position. What are we missing? There's a drum missing from in there. We've done everything in this room. Hmm. Back where it belongs. Ah. Okay. Where does that light go? Baseball bat, keg. We got something down here. And to numero tres. Ah, there we go. Leave the crime scene when you're ready. But wasn't there one thing that we didn't move on the first floor? Yeah, there's one piece of furniture we've not moved back. It's gotta be in here. It doesn't go over here, does it? No. We're missing something, though. Yeah, there. Where is this? Anybody watching this video now is probably shouting at the screen. Is like, it's so obvious. Or, you know, you walk past it like 15 times. There it is. I wouldn't be happy with myself if we left without completing everything. There we go. Leave no sights behind. Now we can go down and be happy that everything is complete. What's the laundry room key for, though? We need to go in the laundry room? Is this... No, it's just a bathroom. It's not a laundry room. Okay, so we got to get rid of one more bag. And... I'm curious what's in the laundry room now. Oh, yeah, we destroyed that door, didn't we? Laundry room. Oh, this is the laundry room, isn't it? Ooh. Money, money, money. Don't mind if I do. Sad and happy is equal sappy. We took it. Okay. Well, the laundry room was certainly worth checking out, wasn't it? Da ching. Okay. We are done here. People wouldn't leave the front door wide open, would they? La 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 la. Oops. How do we do? Are you sure you want to proceed? You will not be able to continue cleaning further. Yes, I'm happy we've done a good job. One hundred percent blood, perfect score. One hundred percent crash, perfect score. One hundred percent furniture, perfect score. And we got all the evidence. One hundred percent, yeah. Probably took me longer than it would most of you, but I think we did okay. I'm happy with this score. And we found, so we had $15,000 from the job itself and earned $2,450 from borrowed items. Nice. Final income, $17,450. And there we have it, folks. Crime Scene Cleaner. Thank you very much for watching. If you did indeed enjoy the video, please feel free to hit that like button and the subscribe button. It would be amazing. And subscribe for more content. See you in the next one. Let me know what you thought of the video and let me know if you're going to get Crime Scene Cleaner yourself. Bye for now, everybody. And thank you again.